Hey guys, I have something a little special for you guys today. Um, a very different belt. It's a Macho Man Randy Savage tribute belt and I worked with a guy named Gavin on this. He owned Squared Circle Belts and uh, he designed the plates, had the plates made. And um, I just went ahead and helped him out with the paint and the leather. So this is a really fun belt to do and um, I'll give y'all a little look-see. So obviously this was a custom made strap. There was no replica to go off of this. So um, I just wanted to make like a nice tight curve around the plates, but still let the tips of the stars hang off. As you can see on the bottom and the top. Give you a little look at the paint job. Nice and smooth. So the leather work is obviously custom, the, uh, the cuts and, you know, all the, the different styles that I tried to incorporate it. I just kind of threw some things together that I thought would look nice and uh, this little cut here, you can see. Um, is based off of the Wrestlemania 4 winged eagle. So, if anybody is familiar with that, the cut is very similar. And I decided to put a border around the pop property plate. See, I made the ends here uh, curved. I just think it looks nicer. So, again, that was just like a little custom thing that I did to make the belt one of a kind and the best that I can make it. Down over here, got the same thing going on, the same style cut, um, but we have a nice little stamp here that says squared circle belts, and let me try and get a good view on this. Hmm. I don't know why my camera won't focus, maybe over here. Happy. Let's see, maybe a bye. Ah, oh, there we go. Okay, finally. So you can see it says squaredcirclebelts.com if anybody's interested in getting their own little custom belt or, you know, they have lots of other tribute belts coming. Um, you can contact him or me. Like I said, his name's Gavin. He's a really nice guy. He's got really awesome work. And I just went ahead and threw my crafted by Miss B stamp right there. So, um, we decided to go with a standard black backing. Although maybe like lavender would have been cool. Or orange. But you can see the uh, tips of the plates. Nice smooth back in. So yeah. So this belt was a ton of fun to do. It's always nice trying something new and kind of being able to put my own like creative flair onto something. So I hope y'all enjoyed the video. I hope y'all like the belt, and like I said, if y'all have any questions, you know who to contact. Alright, thanks. Goodbye.